And our first for the night, we have Bruno Silva taking on Shower of Putin, Maga Madov, the Cyclops, I like to call him, the one eyed monster. I'm going to go with Shower of Putin in this matchup. I think that Bruno Silva's chin is completely gone, guys. After that Pereira fight, he's been doing the stanky leg in every single fight, it seems, that he's been put in. Uh, you know, getting dropped, getting unstruck by Gerald Mearshart on the feet at kickboxing range. And that's where, like, Shower of Putin's going to have it in this matchup. Also, if Bruno Silva tries to wrestle, uh, wrestle Shower Button like he did in that Alex Pereira fight, that's not going to end, uh, end well because Shower Button stuffs the takedowns and makes you pay for it from what we've seen on the regional scene. I feel like Shower Button at minus 200, I played him for two units. I'm pretty confident that he gets a job done. I think that Bruno Silva is definitely past his prime. And you guys are going to say the people on Bruno Silva. He's never been TKO'd. Do he's never been KO'd? Have you, have, have you been watching his fights since the Alex Pereira fight? Like, guys... Have you been watching it? Dude's been literally doing this stanky leg in every single fight since that fight. Um, I, I just can't trust this guy's chin anymore. And I feel like Shara Button, at the kickboxing range, will be able to tie up Bruno Silva from that range. And if Bruno Silva eventually tries to get desperate... I see Maga, uh, Maga Madov, you know, lighting him up when he tries to get inside. I just don't really like this matchup whatsoever, uh, stylistically for Bruno Silva. And I do like this matchup stylistically for Maga Madov, not giving him someone that's going to wrestle him to death immediately into the UFC. Uh, so yeah, give me Cyclops first round TKO or maybe, uh, maybe the start of the second round for sure. On to the next one, boys. Let's go.